Cast Alum manufactures high-quality cast and machined aluminium components for the world automotive market. We produce steering gear housings, power takeoff housings and covers, transmission casings, and safety critical suspension knuckles. Cast Alum, as an independent manufacturer, was created after a management buyout in 2009. One in ten vehicles produced in Europe has a steering gear housing manufactured at the Cast Alum plant here in Welshpool, Mid Wales. In the decade since the facility was built, we've become the global supplier of choice for cast aluminium and machined automotive components. So, how have we done this? It's the combination of our people and processes. Here's Managing Director Peter Radcliffe to talk about processes. In order to succeed in a very competitive market, our strategy has always been to have the best automated processes for casting in aluminium. Therefore, we have eight fully automated high-pressure die casting cells and also three squeeze casting cells. Combined with our machining and x-ray processes, we have what it takes to produce the highest quality components for the most demanding of markets. Cast alum supplies parts to the UK, Germany, Poland, Italy, Canada and Mexico. 70% of all our production is for export, with components going into vehicles produced by Jaguar, Aston Martin, BMW, Porsche, Mercedes, Ford and many other makes. We have an industry-leading level of automation at Cast Alum. Let's take a look at one of our high-pressure die-casting cells. Each cell has its own integral bulk melting tower furnace. This ensures that the correct quantity and quality of metal is always on hand. Recyclable material from the trim press is fed directly back into the furnace. This eliminates any possibility of contamination between differing grades of aluminium. The die casting process is closely monitored and controlled. A typical casting cycle from melt to finished part would involve a hundred signals through its activating, controlling and monitoring equipment. The casting cycle automatically stops at any stage if the desired process parameters are not met. In essence, the machine will not make a scrap part. These fully automated units operate in the range of 1,000 to 1,600 ton locking force. They're highly suited for the production of complex, thin-walled castings. These include steering gear housings and transmission casings. Since 2001, the Welsh Pool site has produced approximately 10 million hydraulic steering gear housings using our enhanced high-pressure die casting processes. These complex housings are required to be of an extremely high integrity and leak-free after extensive machining. Since 2007, we've seen a significant shift from hydraulic to mechanical steering gear systems. This has mainly taken place in the smaller car sector, such as the Fiat 500 and Ford KA. Car Stanham now produces 700,000 gear housings per year for this market. Whereas the small car sector has turned to mechanical steering gears, the large car and higher performance sectors have turned to electronically power-assisted steering housings. Cast Alum has secured major contracts for the supply of over 600,000 units per year. Our three squeeze casting cells also have their own integral tower furnace and use recyclable material from the trim press. The process is ideally suited to the manufacturing of high-integrity castings with a requirement of thick wall sections and mechanical properties approaching those of a forged component. These include steering and suspension knuckles for high-performance vehicles and also covers and housings for power takeoff units. Cast Alum produces in excess of 250,000 sets of PTU castings per year using the squeeze casting process. Each set consists of a case and cover casting which together house the drive mechanisms for four-wheel drive mode in both on- and off-road vehicles. 
Traditionally, these parts were cast or forged in iron or steel for the strength and durability that's required. However, our squeeze casting process meets all the demanding property requirements for these components, whilst offering all of the design flexibility and weight-saving benefits of an aluminium casting. In 2009, Cast Alum built a dedicated machine shop within the existing Welsh Pool facility to provide a full service to both new and existing customers. We will soon have 16 four-axis horizontal machining centres, all benefiting from a clean, climate-controlled air supply. We deliver 200,000 transmission cases a year. We cast them in our 1,600-tonne high-pressure die-casting cell and then machine them using our state-of-the-art CNC machining centres. To support our die-casting processes, we have three X-ray units. Two of these are manually operated in real time by our skilled technicians, who X-ray 20% of everything that is produced. The third unit is an automatic process that makes its own assessment of all safety-critical parts we produce. To complement the X-ray processes, we also have dedicated coordinate measuring machines, fully automated pressure testing equipment, and gauging areas. We aim to keep ahead of competition by maintaining our equipment and skills to the highest levels of productivity and quality. To that end, we've invested around 12 million pounds in the first 18 months that Cast Alum has been locally owned. However, none of the investment we make in new equipment would be valuable without a skilled and committed workforce. Here's Human Resources Manager Hannah Barrett to talk about our people. We take great pride in our workforce, so they take an even greater pride in their work. Our employee numbers have increased from an original 30 to now over 140. Our operating technicians are so much more than machine minders. Their main role is to maintain all the functions of the casting cell, the furnace, the die casting machine and the robotics. This enables us to maintain our required output levels. They also inspect and pack the finished products. Many of the people within Cast Alum have cross-functional skills and almost all of the technical and leadership positions that have become available have been filled by internal promotions. Enabling this has been an ongoing training programme at all levels of the workforce. We believe that learning is a lifetime experience and at Cast Alum, all our employees receive an annual personal development review. They each own a training and development plan that gives them the necessary preparation to do something different and better should a problem arise. Training at Cast Alum has been recognised on a number of occasions with regional and national training awards. The company is an investor in people. A significant aspect in our future skills development programme are the apprenticeship schemes that we fill with local young people. Their energy and new ideas will be an ongoing benefit to the business. We also take our environmental responsibilities seriously by recycling and minimising our impact on the local landscape and wildlife. Cast Alum, combining people and processes to be the global supplier of choice for cast aluminium and machined automotive components.